Hello, welcome to episode 23 of SOS Stockport County. Thanks for coming back, it really means a lot. Right, today's episode, we've got Cardiff. Cardiff in the FA Cup, um, third round. Now, they're a championship team. I'll be honest with you, I don't think we're going to get anything from it. I never really do, because they're above us in the league. Surely, they should be beating us. But, as we know this year, especially in the cup competitions, if my lads turn up, um, we can beat anyone on our day. We're at home, so hopefully the crowd will get behind us. So, you never know. You never know in football. Now, it is January, um, so we can sign players. We can't do a lot, I'll be honest with you. And I don't really think we need a lot. Um, the only positions I'm a bit worried about are my wings. Um, I've got Furlong, who's more of an attacking midfielder, who can cover on the wings. So, apart from that, I've just got three wingers. I'm going to try and sign Bobby Grant, who I think, for the level we're at, is a decent player. So, here is Cardiff. They're uh, 13th in the championship, so they're just below mid-table. Um, the form's not that great. They haven't won in five games. So hopefully they'll carry that form into to us. Um, Scott Young's the manager. I'll be honest with you, I don't know much about him. He's a Welsh lad though, isn't he? Um, they've still got some decent players. I mean, they're in the Premier League not too long ago. Hopefully they'll underestimate us and they'll play a bit of a B team and uh, we can do something at Edgley. Okay, the tactics today is just the, the tactic I always use. I'm still going to go attacking. I'm going to go at, go for them. Uh, I've got two up top. Well, we've got Ingram in net. Uh, Colin Ameson in the centre of defence. O'Leary on the left. Baldock's going to play on the right. Um, we've got May and Chow in the middle. Thompson on the right. Mendes on the left. Uh, Darlington and Maynard up front. Okay, team talk. Now, I'm going to be calm. I'm always calm with the lads, even though I get giddy when the game's on. Um, but I'm going to stay calm and say good luck lads go and pull off an upset we can do this today come on boys Hi Bert I was just wondering if I could ask you some questions before today's game yeah yeah sure yeah it's Fry Badger with Sky Sports News um, basically wondering how hard are you when it comes to team training your team seems tight as a duck's ass. everything seems so fluent your football's really beautiful your scoring goals and especially against the Spurs match how, what was your reaction to that? I bet you wanted to run off into the toilets and have a cheeky one, did you? <laughs> uh, I did, yeah. I did have a cheeky one. Uh, had a couple of beers. <laughs> no, it was a fantastic result. Um, couldn't have been proud of the boys. Uh, chuffed a bits, mate, to be fair. Um, hopefully, we'll get that spirit again today. And uh, they can do me proud. I heard there was a bit of antics with Joey Thompson trying to reenact two girls, one cup on the late night um, binge drinking session. Is that true, uh, Bood? Rumours, mate. I mean, I think that's coming with the fact that we're becoming a bit more... Our profile's rising, um, I think, and these kind of rumours are just rumours. Do you know what I mean? I, I don't think it's true. I'll be honest with you, I don't think it's true. So what kind of style are you going for today? Obviously not doggy, but um, are you going attacking or defensive? Um, attacking. I always go attacking. When do I... I don't even know what defensive means, do I? I always, always go attacking. So... Uh, we're not going to change our style, no, we're going to go for it. Uh, what's what's up your sleeve, Bird? What's what's the answers to this match against Cardiff? Nothing. Just same same thing, mate. Same thing. We're just going to go, we're just going to go for it. We're going to hope, hopefully turn up and we're going to go for it. Yeah, there's been rumours too, Bird. I don't know if it's true, but Ryan Hall, uh, we heard that he... He was in Iceland the other day and mugged a poor old eight-year-old woman of some fish fingers. Is that true at all? Really? <laughs> no. Uh, it, well, he told me that he got the fish fingers first and she hit him with a handbag and he defended himself. So uh, I'm on his side. Do you think the beast, Nicky Maynard, will come up trumps against Cardiff like he did Spurs? Demolish Spurs. Do you think he can do it again? The guy's an animal. Um, I think he's been underrated his whole career he's been fantastic for us he's scored so many goals he scores he, he scores important goals that's what's important with Nicky uh, he's a little magician so if he turns up today he'll score against anyone so we'll have to wait and see thanks for the questions today Bood um, I was just wondering can I have a sneaky hug you're an absolute legend um, I've got you on my wall and everything and I've even got you when I open up my phone your pictures there and I've even sometimes solitaped a picture to my wife and um, Honestly, um, unreal. You're just, just a beautiful man. Keep it up. Uh, this is Sky Sports. Thanks for the interview, Bood. See you later. Stockport County versus Cardiff City. 
Cardiff kick off the first half here at Edgeley. Can we cause an upset? Can Nicky May now turn up and score a screamer? We'll have to wait and see. Baldock now with a throw in. Throws it to Chow. Chow passes it back to Baldock. Come on, boys. Thompson on the ball now. I like how the highlights have all been us. Maynard's shot's deflected. And uh, Noon gets it. He pings it forward. Finds Forrest Dieri. But hopefully one of my lads are going to defend that. Cole does. Gives it back to Ingram. Oh, come on. It's nervy. It is nervy. Whittingham now for Cardiff. Come on, lads. Don't, don't let them play. Don't let them play. Get tackling. Get stuck in. Forrest Dieri now. He's found Whittingham. Whittingham passes it back to Rawls. Rawls. Oh, well done. Baldock intercepts that. Trying to find Maynard. Maynard finds Chow. Chow again, just giving the ball away. Something we do a lot that. We win headers and we just head it straight to the opposition. Oh, brilliant bit of football from Cardiff. Good save and we get it away. Well, that's time flying fast then. Blimey, that clock was going well quick. There's Maynard trying to find Danger. Danger's been tackled. Maynard's got it back. Chow's on the ball. Chow scores. Is that a goal? Come on. Definitely is a goal. 1-0, I don't know what was going on with the bottom bit then, took a bit of time to catch up, here's the replay, um, Maynard here, passes it to Thompson, Thompson, lovely little layoff, Tim Chow who's onside, I was a bit confused then because whatever was happening before in the previous play was sticking on the bottom, and Joey I just, have we actually scored, really, so I didn't know what was going on, oh Maynard's picked up a knock at the end of the first half, a facial injury, can't we get one of them masks on? There you go, end of the first half. 1 0 to County. Whew. Uh, I tell you, come on. Um, I was a bit surprised by the goal, I'll be honest with you. I was getting confused with that stuff at the bottom, I didn't know what was happening. Um, you just, you're just always waiting for when you score a goal against a bigger team, you're always waiting for it to be taken away, aren't you? Um, Nicky Maynard's picked up a facial injury, but he's no more knackered than anyone else, so. What's he got? A black eye, bust nose, tough titty, Nicky. Get back out there. I'm going to be calm and so say you've played well, but there's room for improvement. We can play better than this. I know we can. And here we go. We kick off the second half at Edgeley. Come on, boys. Cheetahland is pumping. They're absolutely buzzing. Can we hang on, though? Can we hang on? Um, if it's still 1-0 with 60 minutes to go, I might do some uh, something different, I'll be honest with you. And uh, Baldock's picked up a facial injury. I mean, what's going on? It's punching my lads in the face. Come on, boys. We're lower league. We're tougher. We play in a much tougher division. I'm going to leave them both on, though, because, I mean, Baldock's doing really well. He's on a 7.2. It's only his face, isn't it? Oh, come on, lads. I mean, look at Edge of the Park today. It's absolutely rammed, isn't it? I can't see an empty seat anywhere. Um, not much is happening in the second half, but I'll tell you what, I don't care. I just want to stay 1-0. I've broke my rule. Now I'm going to keep playing attacking football, but I have changed my formation. <laughs> Shock horror. Um, we've got 20 minutes to go here, and I want to wang on. I want to beat him. So we're going to put Cullen up on his own up front. He's coming on. Um, he plays best as an advanced forward, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, Chow's going to go more central. And I've brought Kenyon on. Him and May are going to sit in front of the back four. May's going to be my ball winner. Um, Kenyon's just going to sit there as a defensive midfielder. <sighs> you know what? You know how it is, boys. You know how it is. It's tense. Here we go. Ball that we were throwing. I've told him to concentrate from the sideline. Oh, come on, lads. Here's May on the edge of the box. He's going to have a shot. He has had a shot. Oh, wow. He's hit the woodwork. A little bit the other way and oh that could have been game over but here we go Cardiff with the corner May heads it away but just don't head it far enough gives it straight to Malone who's a decent player Malone's give it to Pilkington Pilkington gonna get the ball and he can't it gets blocked but only as far as Gunnarsson Gunnarsson gives it out to Manga Manga's trying to find someone but Olivia wins the header but again we just give it away we win the header and we give it away come on Kenyon poor tackle, don't know what he was doing, here's Cullen now, Cullen's sprayed out to Thompson, Thompson, first time, Cullen with fresh legs, can he get onto it, the blonde lad, he does, he's found Tim Chow, Tim Chow has a shot, oh my god, are you having that, are you having it, come on, 2-0, two 2-0, nil. Two nil. oh man, this was Premier League, I tell you, look at that, Cullen there, he finds Tim, Tim, lovely touch, lays it off, booms it in, 
Oh, man, I could kiss him on the lips. I could get in and kiss him. Oh, man. Less than 10 minutes to go. We've had 10 chances each. They've edged it. We've both hit the woodwork. <sighs> Can we really do this? Come on. <sighs> Told them to tighten up. Keep it tight. Unlike my bum, which is 50p, 20p, 50p, 20p. <sighs> come on, lads. Come on, come on, come on. No highlights. It's good highlights in my book. 11 shots each. There's just edging it. We are absolutely knackered. Come on, lads. Is this going to be the full-time? Please be the full-time highlight. They can't score two goals in 10 seconds. They are not Man United. Come on. Aimson now. Aimson. Just ugh, boom it. Yeah, that's what I want to see. That's what I want to see. Thompson's flicking it on. Cardiff is still on the ball. I don't want to see that. Come on, lads. Here's Malone now on the left-hand side. What can Malone do? Enough. That's it. That's it. I could not be prouder. I could not be more proud. Whoa, whoa. I'm going to be passionate and say people have written us off. You probably have written us off. I've written us off. I'll tell you what, this team, right, they might not always be that consistent in the league. But wow, when they want to turn up, put me through it, mate. They put me through it. And there you go, loads of green. As my friend Loki says, I see a green. Apparently we won with kids, um, young Stockport side, came out on top against a much more experienced Cardiff team on a wet afternoon at Edgley Park. <sighs> Ding dong battle. That was amazing. That was, that what, that is what this game is all about. It's amazing. The best game out there, I tell you. That's good, isn't it? Um, obviously with the financial situation, um, it's not been the greatest, but... We made 200 grand there from that game against Cardiff. And, I mean, Edge of the Park was full, wasn't it? So, hopefully, getting the next round, we might get a big team, go to their place, get a bit more money. Here we are, fourth round draw. Can't believe I'm here, I'll be honest. It's an amazing achievement. Reading on Stoke and Spurs. Barnsley, I've got Sheffield United, a bit of Yorkshire Derby. <coughs> right now, Preston, we'll just be able to play. Okay, don't take them. Oh, Gateshead. Come on, Gateshead. Austin Villa or Sunderland against County. Austin Villa and Sunderland are championship teams. Do you know what? For a minute then I thought Premier League, but they're in the championship. I'll have to have a look at them. Right, the episode. We were going to play the next four games off camera and I was going to finish off with a league game against Shrewsbury. But we're still in the cup. So I don't know what to do yet, if I'm honest. Um, I'm going to play these four games. And I'll show you them as highlights. Um, Villa and Sunderland are playing each other in um, on the 17th. So we've got a while to find out who we're going to face in the next round. Um, I think they're both in the playoffs, find out somewhere um, in the championship. So the different kettle of fish than um, Cardiff. It's going to be a tough game, whoever we have really. Um, got to be the end of the road. But we're away, so they've both got big stadiums. It might be a nice little payday for us. Um, so yeah, enjoy the highlights. And I'll see you back in a bit when we'll find out who we're going to play in the FA Cup. <laughs> Rackles now on the right hand side. He's passed it into Vincente, I think it is. He crosses it into Henderson. And there you go. Half an hour gone. And it's 1 0 Rochdale. Ryan Hall's chasing onto this on the left hand side. Can he get a cross? And he does. Oh, Kung Fu kick from Cullen. 1 1. 15 minutes to go. Come on, boys. Furlong now on the right hand side. First time passed out was Thompson. Thompson, can he get a cross? And he does. It's low. Straight to Cullen. Oh my god, two goals in about two minutes from the Cullen. 2 1. Come on. Just a bit of news um, that left winger, Bobby Grant, who was trying to sign, we've signed him. So hopefully, got a few more options now, um, especially when the players are tired and that. Um, so pretty happy with that, I'll be honest with you. Cullen chasing onto it now. What are you going to do, mate? He's passed it to Mendes. Can Mendes get across and he has done? More oh, brilliant. Maynard rolls up. Scored with his head. It's 1 0. Mendes chasing down the right hand side now. Whip it in, mate. He's going to take his man on. No, he has whipped it in. Oh, straight to Chow. Chow's first shot saved. Second shot goes in. 2 0. Mendes passes it to Brown. Brown captain today. He can whip a ball in, but he hasn't. He's trying to find Mendes again. Don't know if he's going to get to it. No, he has done. He's in the box. It's a low cross. Straight to Nicky Maynard. Wow. 3-0, this, this has got to be game over, 3-0. Irwin chasing on this now on the right. Can he whip it in, get a tackle in? No, he's whipped it in. Oh, wow, decent goal, that. Find Sheenan. 
and it's uh, 3 1. Corner ball now, Grant to take it. It's high, he's floated it to Nicky Maynard. Nicky Maynard, first time shot. Wow. <laughs> it's a deflection off a defender. Own goal by Willis. Not really a Nicky Maynard special, but we'll take it. 4 1. Free kick now for Coventry. Wallace on the edge of the box. He's low cross. Finds Wiseman. Two minutes to go, and it's 4 2. And here we are. We're going to play Sunderland in the fifth round. Um, they've beat Austin Villa with a goal in the 113th minute. Uh, Sunderland's defence looked beastly. Um, Villa didn't look like they played very well. So, got a trip to the Stadium of Light. Pretty big stadium. Uh, hopefully make a few pennies out of it. Here's Brown now. Brown on the right hand side. Passes it short to Mendes. Mendes crosses it in straight to Nicky Maynard. Classic county goal. 1-0. New boy Grant now, he's got the ball in the middle of the park, he's surrounded by three players, but it's a lovely pass towards Nicky, who's got onto it, takes one touch and blasts it in, that is an absolutely fantastic goal, 2-0, Grant now charging forward again, played brilliantly today, new guys found Chow, Chow first time pass to Maynard, Maynard again, half an hour ago, and we've had an hat-trick from the master. Welcome back from the highlights now, as you can see, we've been fantastic, I think they've got a high, gone on a high from Cardiff, and they've just carried that buzz over. I mean, the Rochdale game, I'll be honest with you, away at Rochdale, that was a tough, tough game. Um, who scored? Yeah, Cullen. Cullen got both from goals. Um, but yeah, that was a grind. That was a real tough game, but we won it. And then we went to Coventry. Um, absolutely destroyed Coventry, I'll be honest with you. Um, I think, yeah, Nicky Maynard scored two. Um, Chow got one. And um, Coventry got an own goal right near the end, which is pretty disappointing for them, but well deserved. And then we went to Cheltenham and total domination. So proud. Nicky Maynard got an hat trick. Now, I did plan on playing four games, but um, obviously the FA Cup game's been picked for the 27th. Um, so the Lincoln game's been moved behind that. Um, and it's given us a nice rest. I think we've had seven days off since the Cheltenham game. Um, so we're pretty fresh. Um, but before we look at the team, I want to look at the league and a few other things. As you can see, uh, we are sitting pretty at the top of League Two. Uh, Mansfield have still got that game in hand on us, um, but we're five points clear. So even if they win it, we're still two points clear. So we I mean we are far and high above expectations this season. I'm absolutely buzzing with that. We've got the three best players in the league. Nicky May now that's now the top goal scorer in the league. Um, so we can't really ask for much more with the with the league. I'll be honest with you, I'm really, really happy. <laughs> um, as I've said before, we were predicted to finish 15th. So the fact that we're, we're top, you know, not long pushing for promotion, we are top of the league. It's fantastic. Now my star pupil uh, in this episode has to be Nicky Maynard. He's been brilliant. Um, he's scored 31 goals in 42 games this year. He's an absolute goal machine. He's pretty quick. He can finish. He's got a bit of flair. Do you know what? He's a great player at this at this level. I mean, he doesn't always turn up, but when he turns up, he turns up in style. Here's Sunderland, and they've got Michael Laudrup as their manager. What an absolute legend he is. Top, top player. Um, I think he did a good job at um, Swansea. He won a trophy, didn't he? Um, I think it's daft to sack him, I'll be honest with you. So you know what? They've got a great manager. Um, they're a good club. They're sixth in the championship. Um... <laughs> Big stadium, big support, mental aren't they up there in the northeast? This is gonna be this is gonna be solid. This is gonna be hard. I can see this being my hull. Like Hull we uh, did really well, didn't we in the League Cup, came up against Hull and they just did us over. We're class above. I can see that happening today. As always though, I'm gonna show no fear and we are gonna play my two up top attacking tactic. Um not to make a few changes because of suspensions and fitness or whatever. Um, but it's not too much. Um, we've got Ingram in net. Brown's going to play at left back. Got Baldock at right back. Lennon and Cole in the middle. Um, Ameson's uh, had a bit of a knock still. Uh, we've got May and Chow in the middle. Mendes on the right. Hall on the left. Uh, and Maynard and Cullen up front. Who, you know, Maynard in the league got 23 goals. Cullen scored 12. These lads can score. So I'm going to be calm. Um, I'm going to say nobody expects us to get a result. Just go out there and enjoy. No pressure. Because there isn't any pressure. Stadium of Light is massive. Um, these are players, a lot of these players are playing in the Premier League. So do you know what? Let's stop one, lads. Come on, Kelly. 
Sunderland versus Stockport County. Sunderland kick off here at the Stadium of Light. What's going to happen today, eh? You never know with this beautiful game of football, do you? Here's Lenz on the attack already, straight away for uh, Sunderland. Eddie, Eddie finds Barini. Barini finds Lenz. Oh, get the ball away. I thought it was going to be an early goal. Um, it is getting a bit late, so you know what? We're probably going to go out that way, so I thought I might as well have a beer. It's a school night, but sod it. I mean, you can play sometimes a whole half and see one highlight. Um, it's just highlight after highlight. It's only been six minutes. I mean, no real chances, like, but... What's going on? Come on. Oh, good save, Ingram. Oh, what a save that was. Free kick now. Sunderland whips it straight in the box. We head it away. Well done. Straight back to him now. Can Hall get on him? No, Hall's just let him walk straight past him. Uh, Brown. Brown deals with it. That was a bit weird. But Brown dealt with it and kicked it clear. Only as far as Eddie. Eddie passes into Virginia. Virginia's a bread cut. I mean, a lot of these players have had uh, Premier League experience. Bonvecchia, can't say his name. Here's uh, Hollybass. God, they've got some right good names, aren't they? Sunderland. Hollybass gets it in the box. Easy for Ingram. Come on, boys. Here's Hall now on the left hand side. The ball's gone forward. We can may not get onto it. Oh, he has done. Mistake by the defender. Oh my God. Oh my God. Scenes. Have you seen that? Nicky Maynard. He's on fire. Come on, super, super manager. Watch this here, Hall. Now, nah, Maynard's not getting onto that. Virginia then, wow. Just... Come on. Sunderland kick off here. I'll tell you what, this might become my lucky t-shirt. Wow. We have silenced the stadium alive, but you know what? Big clubs bounce back and here's Barini. He's coming forward. He's got so much time on the ball. He goes past one man. He goes past another man. He has a shot. Keeper saves it. Falls straight to Lens. And what was I saying? Straight back. Jermaine Lens. 1-1. One, one. That's... Oh, God. Man. It was like, wow. Why do we do this here? Look. Just straight past one. Straight past another. I mean, good save from Ingram. But... Why was no one on him then? Poor defending. 1-1. One, one. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Hallbass now on the left-hand side. Gets past him with ease. Come on, get a foot in. Straight in the box. Scramble it. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Hit it, defender, hit the keeper. Came back out, he had another shot, hit the post. Wow, we have survived there. We have on gone there, aren't we, lads? Here comes Sunderland again. Oh, come on, boys. Hallbass finds Eddie. Eddie. To Marivas. Oh, Borini there. No, yeah, you can't miss that, can you? You can't miss that. I mean, to be fair, ever since we've scored, it's been do whatever we can to help Sunderland score, really, haven't we? And, and anyone has scored that. My grand would have scored that with one leg and a freaking blindfold on. And uh, these are looking quite good today. These Sunderland look like they're here and they're ready. Borini now. Oh, he's gone past him easily, hasn't he? Oh, he's gone past him again. Oh, and there we go. Another goal. Ah, oh, 3-1 to Sunderland, half an hour gone. Here we go, look at that, that was easy wasn't it? Boom, 3-1. Here's Jones, proper name, on the right hand side, crosses it in, Eddie scored, no! Ingram with a save, oh. Ingram with a save, falls to Mar Rivas, 4-1. Look at this, boom, four, game over. Well, end of the first half and uh, the highs of going 1-0 up have, have quickly turned into lows. But you know what, I'm not too downbeat. Um, I suppose I'm pretty chuffed with how we're doing in the league really. And that's our main focus. I mean, to do well in the Cups this year, I mean, it, both Cups have been, have been fantastic, so... I can't be angry with them really. And we kick off here, the second half, at the Stadium of Light. Let's hope it stays at 4-1. Oh, do you know what, I take 5-4 to us. Don't get me wrong, but... Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. See, why did Chow look like a granddad then? That running like that. <laughs> About one mile an hour. Come on, lads. Oh, great tackle for Maynard. Gets it to Mendes. Mendes to Chow. Look up, Tim. Oh, he's found Maynard. Maynard's run through, but I don't know if he's going to have anyone in there. He has done. Oh, he's found Ryan Hall. Come on, 4-2.
This was a really good goal there. Chow there. Pinged it forward. Maynard got onto it. First time cross. Didn't think Ryan Hall would get to that, but he did at the end. His foot came out of nowhere. And it's 4 2. I've encouraged him from the sideline. Why not? Let's get free. That's what the county fans are chanting. Can you hear him? We want free. We want free. So we need to give him three. But here's Sunderland now. Here's Eddie. Eddie to Barini. I don't want Barini to get three. Great save. Wow. Oh, May. May, 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 May. He's going off here. May's going off. Stupid tackle. Stupid boy. Second yellow card and he's off. Stupid. Oh, the He's got it forward to Nicky. Nicky one on one with the keeper. He's always dangerous. Oh, Nicky, Nicky, Nicky. This is surely the full time highlight. And it is 4 2 at the Stadium of Light. The FA Cup dream is over. But you know what? Can't be disappointed. I'm going to be passionate and say, despite the result, I'm pleased. Although, Adam May, I'm going to find you two weeks' wages because you're a fanny. Episode 24 what we're going to do. Right, we're only in the league now, and the league's pretty important. We're at the top. And so it is all about the league and seeing if we can actually win the title. So I want to start getting some of this season out of the way. Start getting to the fun bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play the next eight games of Canberra in the league. We'll have a nice highlights package for you to watch at the start of episode 24. And then we're going to have a nice big live com against York at home at Edgley Park against Rich on Twitch's York. Rich on Twitch who's got the English journeyman save. It's like... It's like the second best save out there at the minute behind mine. Um, but yeah, I like him. He's a top, top lad. That's the end of episode 23. Thanks for watching. Um, Superman shirt went out of power in the end. Um, but do you know what? I enjoyed that episode. It was good. Um, beating Cardiff was brilliant. I won't lie. Um, I didn't expect to be a Sunderland, and, but I think we did well. 10 men. We still scored two goals. Um, it's all right, really. Can't grumble. Um, we're doing brilliantly in the league. Top of the league. Hopefully that form will continue because we've started to get really good form in the league. Starting to play really well. Cullen and Maynard are scoring lots of goals. So let's hope that continues in the next eight games off camera. Uh, and then we can come back to play Rich on Twitches, York. Which I'm buzzing about really. Get to highlight my friend. And I also get to humiliate his team and make them look rubbish. Because they are. You know what I mean? But yeah, <laughs> cheers for watching. Honestly, it does mean a lot. Um, I've had quite a few new subs recently. I mean, I haven't been that active at the moment because I've had two weeks off work and I've been away to Wales with my wife and then we went to Paris so obviously you know real life kicks in you have to go on holiday um, but I do plan on making a lot more in the coming weeks and um, being a lot more regular at least a good few a week yeah thanks all the new guys who subbed honestly it really means a lot for you to press that button subscribe to me and um, honestly it really does mean so a lot to me so thank you and um, I just want to say a quick thanks to Fried Badger um, for doing all the questions in the um, pre-game Sky Sports interview and um, cheers mate it means a lot and uh, so yeah thanks thanks for watching I hope to see you back for episode 24 it should be a good one against York uh, and hopefully we'll be seeing now who's going to be winning this league am I going to win it am I going to be a playoff team we don't know yet do you know what I mean I, I, I want to win it I think we're going to win it I think we're on target to win it why not let's do it we stop Port County we're the best team in the world so thank you for watching have a nice day, take care and I'll see you later.